Hey community group leaders, Pastor Jake Thurston here. Uh, so excited just for everything that we have going on. This is a jam-packed video, uh, so you can always read everything in the email below, but figured it might be easier just to communicate everything through a video if you prefer it that way. So first things first, hope your summer has been awesome. I'm sure uh, you guys have had either, either a good break or had a really good time just taking some community opportunities with your, uh, with your groups. And uh, I really hope that you guys are geared up for the fall. But before we get into that, I uh, just want to remind you guys of a really cool opportunity if whether you want to participate in this or your small groups or community groups want to be, uh, want to participate in this. But on August 24th, I had to look at my calendar. August 24th, we're hosting an eight hour spiritual retreat at West Campus called Unplugged. It's gonna be a really awesome way just to learn some new spiritual practices and just to grow in community with either uh, your small group members or uh, other people there. So if you wanna make that event known, uh, look in the email below. I'll have a link to the event there that you can send them. But fall is approaching, which means that we're getting very close to a whole new season of signups. People often want to sign up for groups as soon as they get back into the fall rhythm of things. But here's the difference for this September and our sign-up season is that we are completely changing database systems. <laughs> We're totally changing our system of how groups function and how we do sign-ups. Now, it's going to function very similarly, but it's just through a very different program. Uh, this is why we've been taking the whole summer to uh, recollect our data and our information for your guys' group so we can accurately put everything into this new system. Uh, we just decided this week that we're going to go forward with this new system. If you guys are familiar with Church Community Builder, that's what we used to use uh, for all of our group's management and communication. Now we're moving forward with planting, Planning Center Online. Again, Planning Center Online. Uh, you, I think you guys are going to love this thing. It's going to be a lot more user friendly. It's going to be um, a lot more intuitive for people to sign up. You're going to get really clear notifications. They have a really slick iPhone app that I haven't messed around with yet, but it's just going to make everything so, so good. So I'm going to have some links down below uh, to the website for you to kind of look through and see how groups function and uh, the video of how this new website works. Um, We'll get back to you on whether we're going to have, I don't think we're going to have an event to pull all of our community group leaders together to teach you how to use this thing. Um, but if you have any questions, if you have any questions, please reach out to me or your campus pastor. We want to set you up for success for this fall whenever you get someone who signs up for your group. Um, we want to make sure that you know how to access this and how to have your login information and everything like that. So I'm going to send another email next week with more information on uh, this new system, um, whether it's videos or with details of how we can communicate to get all this stuff figured out. Um, all you need to do is just look at the videos and the links down below in the little category there um, in the email and we'll make that happen. Again, I think you guys are going to love it because we're going to begin signups on September 1st and then they're going to just go uh, on through the fall from there. So lastly, and this is a pretty big one, um, the Lord works in really funny ways. And as you might know, the ransom has uh, begun... Uh, we've, we've, we've started turning into a sending culture um, where if God calls us to go or to send someone, then the, they're going to obey and they're going to go to those uh, new places that God wants them to go. Um, I had just recently been asked to um, take a job at Indiana Wesleyan University. It's the college I attended for my ministry education and uh, my pastoral degree. It, it, every, every part of who I am as a pastor today is because of um, the Ransom's amazing leadership development culture here, but also the education I received at Indiana Wesleyan University, or IWU for short. Um, and the director of the program I went through got a hold of me and asked if I would be willing to consider joining their team as the assistant director of the Kern Ministerial Leadership Program. 
it would essentially consist of me coaching pastoral students. Um, I'd get to teach and lead some of their leadership development um, lessons and some of their spiritual formation lessons. Uh, I'd get to help recruit and double the program, um, as well as go on all of their leadership conferences and leadership events and retreats for personal development and uh, basically get to play this voice in these pastoral students' lives for them to um, pursue their calling. And there's going to be maybe even some opportunities for me to teach at the university down the road, uh, to travel and to speak, um, and a bunch of other things that just line up so much with who I am and how God's wired me and what I'm passionate about. Um, this has been no easy decision whatsoever. It has been so hard. Um, but we know without a doubt that this is where we're being called to go. And so your campus pastors are going to be uh, your main communicators moving forward. We're working hard to find a new spiritual formation pastor who will come and kind of uh, take the whole small groups program um, and ministry to a place that I never could. So rest assured, we're working hard to find a, a new fearless leader for you. Um, but definitely just wanted to fill all of you guys in on what's going on in my life. Uh, nothing's official yet. We'll find out by the end of this week if whether I'll officially be moving down there. But it would be uh, September, early September when we'd be moving. So lots of transitions going on. But um, we're so excited for what God has in store. And uh, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to email me back or get a hold of me. And uh, then we can go from there. So thank you guys so much. Have a great rest of your week. And uh, looking forward to a new season of small groups. Let's do this.